So a lot of people have been asking me about like various supplements I take and what exactly the supplements I do take. So that's that's what today's video is going to be on and like exactly what supplements I do take. So the thing to remember is like everyone's different. Everyone's body type is different, especially mine. So before like I explain all my supplements, I do like good research into what fits best for you and your body type. So for me, all my supplements that I usually go to is um, EHP Labs. I think they're the best for like, that's what um, like all my research I've been doing with these supplements. I think for me, my body type that they're honestly my go-to. But so how I'm gonna do this is I'll talk about like my first, my pre-workout and then intro post and then some of the plant-based stuff I have like I'll mix into my shake. So so to start off, I this is my pre-workout. So this is OxyShred Hardcore. This comes in two flavors. This is lemon sherbet. I like lemon the best. And then the other one's grape. So this pre-work is literally my favorite. This is, I probably could not go working out without this. Um, this makes me extremely focused, dialed in the whole workout and not flat at all and gives me a great pump. And this, this is, I usually just do one scoop of this mixed with, with water. And the thing that I recently got into is this is L-carnitine. So this is metabolism booster and fat burner. So with this, I'll, I'll probably put about two scoops of this, and this is a little scoop, so like I can show you, but on this it says that you can have up to three to six scoops a day with this, but like see the serving size is pretty small. So I'll go about two, uh, yeah, two scoops with this in my oxy shred. So this just gives me like extra metabolism just to, you know, get that extra set in and whatever. So these two mix with the pre-workout is honestly the way to go. I feel awesome when I take this, so. Yeah, so that's that's pretty much my pre-workout. And the thing to remember is when I have my pre-workout meal, I wait a good hour for my whole food to digest in my system because if not, then the actually shred won't have its full effect on it because like you won't get the whole gist of out of your whole workout and you'll feel kind of flat because just with your um, like immune system, it will mix up with like the digestive of, with the food and all that stuff when you take the oxy shred. So I'd wait at least an hour before eating or like after eating, taking this. So, or like, it doesn't matter. You can on an empty stomach too. That'd be good because um, it has some fat burner in it as well. So yeah, but these, honestly, these two from EHP labs are the best that I use for my pre-workout. All right. So secondly, uh, we'll talk about the post-workout. So my post-workout protein, I'll go with the oxy -Y lean protein formula. So this is just strawberry milkshake. So, with this, this has some fat burner in it. So this was like the three fat burner packets I have. But so this is also from EHP Labs. And so a lot of people were also asking about like my post-workout of what protein I have. So honestly like mix it up. So I'll have this, this is the oxy -Y, And so I'll have that. So people have been asking me like why and like plant-based, like what's the difference stuff. Honestly, it's a personal preference. I don't use like plant-based, like I'll have that usually with meals and stuff. So, but the Oxy Y, I'll definitely use this for post-workout and I always mix in my creatine. So I just ordered, this creatine's out from EHP Labs, this is my old creatine that I had. But um, I just ordered some new creatine from EHP that's coming in soon. So, but this is the creatine I've been working with right now. This is just the dietary supplement. So right here, so I go about one to two scoops of creatine right after I finish my workout. Um, I'll usually mix that in with about a scoop of the Oxy Y. And so I'll usually mix it up. So if I'm not feeling the Oxy Y, this is pretty good too. So this is something called Isopept. This is my Isopept Zero from EHP Labs as well. So this is um, really good too. This is really fast absorption uh, post-workout protein. And so you can mix it with just one scoop of uh, protein. It's probably like six to eight ounces with water or like non-fat almond milk. That's what I usually mix it with. So, and I see like if I'm feeling crazy, I'll go uh, one scoop of the Oxy Y with the Isopept and then two scoops of creatine at the end for my whole post workout. It really depends like on how like hard I'm going that day or how long I like was going for the whole workout just to like recover my muscles and just refuel them. All right, so next um, we have this is my plant based protein. So, you can honestly use this like for post-workout too, but like the plant-based is obviously vegan-based and it doesn't have like like the other proteins like you get at like, say like why the lean protein formula. So it's pretty much different. It's just like, you know, obviously plant-based and just it has like 
It's a lot of different flavors, but I honestly love it. This is like, this is something to really look into. So I like, I just started going with this, but Bless is honestly the best. Um, it's the way to go. I have like, there's a bunch of different flavors you can get. I ordered, um, they just uh, have chocolate uh, coconut, but this is my vanilla that I just got. So, but with this, I have recently just been mixing this into my protein shakes and various other things. So like, I don't have this right after my post-workout. What I'll mix this in is just like, usually with meals and stuff. So like, if I have like a good post-workout meal or like in between like workouts just for like, because I usually eat about six to seven meals a day. So this will be like, along with one of my meals, I'll just put almond milk and then mix it in. So this is pretty good, plant-based. I highly recommend this as well. So yeah, so that's that. And so this is also plant-based too. It's just the sticker stuff. But yeah, so this is chocolate and vanilla. So, but yeah, I, I honestly really, especially if you're vegan, vegetarian, and if you don't want any of like the dairy or like um, the wine like that, this sort of protein, um, the plant-based is um, the way to go. The amino acids I use, people have been asking me like, oh, like, do you use BCAs and like, you know, what amino acids you use? So like, the BCAs, I don't really, like, I stick away from like the, the branch amino acids. So like, I like the essential complete amino acid. So I get it like straight, you know, from the like exact amino acid. So this is what this is from. So this is, you can get this at like GNC or like, honestly, like you could probably get this at, honestly, like on, um, like on Amazon or whatever. So this is just essential amino, like complete amino acid. So um, this is good for like uh, recovery and support in the muscles and like that stuff and like hydrate some. So like I was saying earlier, so with, for my second workout of the day, I'll usually go, I'll hit my main muscle groups in the morning and then my second workout, I'll go cardio. So I'll usually, this is really key for me for my second workout. So this um, helps my muscle recovery and just all that stuff without taking pre-workout and just gets me through the second workout of the day. And also like you can put this in juice forever, or have this like throughout the day because this is just again good for recovery and all that stuff. So, but yeah, so this is what I use the, and it's a great flavor. This honestly takes like, um, what is it? Uh, like a Skittle and a, one of those like Jolly Ranchers things. So yeah, I honestly would recommend this and it has a bunch of electrolytes in it. So yeah, so my amino acids that I take, this is, I usually just go with complete essential ones. I do have the BCAs, like the branch ones. So this is also for muscle recovery and endurance. This is the Extend. So this one was also not bad. I liked that one better just because it was the essential ones and just straight like the complete amino acids rather than the branch. So, but um, with this, I use this so during, so without my pre-workout, I would take this like while my workout so I can, it keeps fueling my muscles and just gets that like nice pump going. So. But yeah, this is just fruit flavored. So I'll use that as well um, at time to time. So I'll really I'll really just mix up with the amino acids, you know. And um, but usually now like days the usually like most protein powder comes with amino acids, you know, but like for me, I just rather like I'm sure this does, but like I'm like for me again, uh, I'd rather just take like strictly just straight like amino acids to mix in like, you know, a recovery drink or like I'll have it, I'll usually have the essential complete amino acids probably like two to three hours after I work out. So lastly, um, people were asking me about like certain pills, you know, what would be good. So for me, to serve like every meal in the morning with my breakfast, I do take uh, one a day. So this is men's one a day. And honestly, this, this has helped me a lot. Like I feel like I feel better taking these. So this has six key vital functions just with like um, energy metabolism booster, you know, heart health, immune health, healthy mu muscle function, cell health, and then healthy blood pressure. And so with me, the amount of like my protein intake is pretty high. So this will help break it down, like all the proteins with my immune system and stuff like that. So that's, that's been pretty vital for me. I'll take one of these, um, with in the morning with my breakfast. And then also I've been recently going with a uh, fish oil, uh, pills because you know, I try to um, eat a good amount of fish. I mean, it's been hard for me because like, I'll have salmon, I don't eat a ton of fish. You know, I'd say I'd probably have like fish probably twice, two to three times a week. So I'll honestly, I don't take these too often. I'll probably go, I try to go one a day, maybe. You know, it might be one every other day, but I mean, 
you don't need these. These are these honestly the main things they are good for is just like really healthy like joint functions and like so that's good for your muscles and stuff and it's also like you know it's good for your brain, skin, eyes and heart. So but I mean a lot of um, bodybuilders have been that I've seen have been taking these and been love them for just like joint movements and just like like greasing them up so you'll get like just healthy like movements with um, just overall muscle movements and joints so um, but yeah I've, I've recently gotten these these are newer that I take and so lastly um, this is also from the EHP labs um, this is the OxyRem deep sleep fat burner so with this this help like sometimes like Oh, I'll have trouble like falling asleep, especially like if I have a really hard workout at night. So I'll take these and the thing you have to remember with these is uh, when you're done eating fully like during the day, this has to be the very last thing that enters your body. So you can't like take this and then have another thing to eat or like drink. Um, I'm sure water would be fine, but like that's the only exception. But so with this, um, it has like melatonin and a little bit of it and then obviously fat burner and it, uh, it, it's really good for muscle recovery so like it's just in your sleep because that's like the biggest key factor in like when your muscles um, grow the most in your sleep and that's when they're recovering for from the tear so this honestly is the best for me so yeah so yeah so this is this wraps up um, all the supplements I take and um, honestly people were also asking me like if I did go with one supplement like and that's it, like pick one of these. That's pretty hard because they obviously do different things for your body. But um, honestly, like if I did pick one, I think that honestly the isopept is the best because with the best absorption post-workout um, protein, um, it literally is like, it's honestly like literally my favorite. You can have post-workout, this honestly works like, you can like, it has great metabolism and just like overall like awesome, 25 grams of protein, zero sugars, no fat, 5.7 BCAs and just like it's I think it's obvious like just overall like the best so for me yeah like it's you know there's really two like there's really like it's awesome very healthy for you extremely lean so yeah the isopept is um, probably my go-to with this but you can get a bunch of different flavors on the HP labs that's just uh, cookies and cream I was looking at this banana one that's pretty good I love uh, bananas but yeah so yeah, that wraps up um, all my supplements. If you guys have any questions about it, you can uh, leave them in the comments below. So, but yeah, thanks for watching. I appreciate all the support in my other videos, and I'll probably um, do another video of like a full day eating type thing uh, because obviously supplements is a different uh, subject with you know my like whole food intake. So, yeah, but I'll I'll do that soon. I'll probably release that somewhat soon, just like you know full day of eating all my seven meals and you know what I make, but. Yeah, alright, appreciate all the support. I'll see you guys.